We have the FL283 hanging today. It's our mid-size line array, our mid-format line array. It's a dual eight low frequency section, fully horn loaded, and a triple one inch uh, horn for the top end. The pattern on the, each module is a 90 by 20. 20 degree vertical is relatively wide for a line array, allowing for fewer boxes to be used for the J part of the array. One of the other key features that, that is involved in the FL283 is the passive cardioid technology. It was actually invented for our line array. One of the challenges with small format and mid format line arrays is they have excessive low frequency radiation out of the back of the cabinet. If you'll notice, the low frequency ports are on the rear of the cabinet. This is a tune resistive port network that we're actually leaking some of the back energy of the forward facing woofers out the rear out of phase with the wrap. So we're getting good cancellation of low frequency at the rear of the cabinet. Up to 12 dB um, low frequency cancellation at the rear. The, each loudspeaker is passive, fully passive. So it's a 16 ohm, 500 watt passive loudspeaker module, allowing for multiples to be used on large amp channels, or you can break things up into smaller amp channels and multi-channel amps. So it gives you lots of options to design around um, whatever DSP or amplifier choice that you have. I'm gonna see how this translates to the video, but I'm gonna play some uh, a bass track and kind of walk around the array and give you an idea of the, of the rear rejection and the pattern control of the array itself. <laughs> 